Greenwall Matongo Library in the heart of Greenwall is an information hub for most learners and students in this area. However, the area has been in a dilapidated condition with a falling roof worsened by the heavy rains which led to closure of the library which only recently reopened. Not only that, computers do not work and they have not enjoyed internet services for close to two years now. Meanwhile, Nathaniel Mahulili Community Library in Okaanja Park struggles with internet and printing services. This public library caters for the surrounding informal settlements with no electricity. So the library has impact on students and people of the community. Uh, we have almost five communities that are served by the library. We have Okahanja Park, Babylon, we have Kilimanjaro, and Oshitenda. So the library helps these students that are not having electricity in their houses. Vantuk Community Libraries are run jointly by the City of Vantuk and the Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture. While the Education Ministry provides human capital and some resources, City of Vantuk maintains the buildings and provides connectivity. The Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture and in particular, the Directorate of Namibia Library and Archive Service is committed to ensure that the citizens and the library users are given their human rights to access quality information at the right time and also in the right format. In as much as we are striving to render quality library services to our clientele, we are also saying that it's not an easy task due to the economic downturn. Hence, we are welcoming friends of libraries. We are also welcoming other stakeholders to assist us in this huge task. The lack of these services continue to have an impact on students and learners that only have these resources to better their studies. Like since I came to know these libraries, there is no Wi-Fi at all. The Wi-Fi doesn't use to, to work. So sometimes you also need to, to get information on, like, on the website and so on, from Wikipedia, Google and so on. So They should come on board and help libraries like uh, providing resources, at least uh, provide more computers or even donate anything even if they don't want to use it. Here is just a place where you can bring those things to. Because students really need to use the computers. As you can see, most students who are staying in the locations, they do not have computers or maybe access to computers. The city of Ventuk did not respond to questions by the time of airing. However, the public relations officer of city of Ventuk, Lydia Amutenya, says they are attending to some of the challenges. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.